No. Alright. Cool. Can we make our own custom Dango plushies or will there be legal repercussions? You can make your own. If it's just for you, you can make your own. Uh, which region has the most number of players in TFT? China. I don't want Blitz with a sword, so... Well, hold here. Why hasn't League started making Little Legends plushies? They've made a few. Although I'd say I have them, but they're at the summit thing. But there's a few Little Legends plushies. So there's a Chonk plushie. And yeah, that would be a different group. That would be the uh, merch group. Not TFT. And also, plushies don't really make that much money. Oh. That's a uh, Galio 2. I mean... I'll take a Galio 2. Cool. I made a free sewing pattern available for the Dangos. If you look up Dangle Plush, there's a Reddit post. Nice. So yeah, if you want to make your own. Bing. Uh, Kid Zeph, appreciate the two months. Celebrating my sub birthday on the same day as Mort's birthday. Oh, I forgot to sell. Oh, well. Item grab bag. Easy cheesy. Okay, this is awkward, but I basically became duelist very quickly here. Hmm. I guess it's a duelist game. This is awkward. Yeah, this is awkward. You say Duelist is the easiest play, now you can show off. I mean, we did it yesterday and I got second with it, so. It was one of my many, many second places. I wasn't here yesterday though, that's fair. I can't argue that logic. I can see the titles now, the week of seconds, pretty much. Uh, okay. I mean, the correct thing to do here is just this and sell the Galio, but... But the Galio 2 is really good. Let me just run this for now. Pair of Yasuos, pair of Gangplanks in a second. Hopefully we win this. If we don't win this, I'll just sell the Renekton. I think the Galio 2 is slightly better here. Ezreal next shop? I mean, that'd be fun, although I already slammed the Zeke, so that's not ideal. Lots of pairs. Let's go. We need you to roll for that Ezreal? I don't know about that one. I don't know about that one. In fact, the correct play here, as much as I hate it, is just that. Keep the win streak going. Three pairs, though. Three pairs is a little rough. Oh, 
Oh well. With so many pairs, do you think you're getting the daily recommended servings? <laughs> True. Oh, that ram assault was juicy. Okay. I mean, can I build a full gadgetine? Is it good? Not really. Not really. Call Soju, he's crying? Why is Soju crying? Uh, we know what item we want. Fingers crossed. It's still there. It's still there. Fingers crossed. It's still there. I mean, I'd be, I'd be happy with either, to be honest here, but let's take it. Cool. Cool, I'm kind of disappointed there's no skincare routine question in the Jeopardy. <laughs> I mean, if, if you guys enjoyed the Jeopardy, we can do it again. I'm down to do it again sometime. Uh, correct play here is I probably should sell the Galio and put in like another Yasuo, but I'd rather keep the win streak going. Pray we hit some two stars pretty quick. Absolutely do Jeopardy again. My wife and I loved playing. Nice. Yeah, I figured it'd be fun for you guys to try like answer along. Bruiser Electro Charge versus Stacked Up Duelist. This is going to be close. The Duelists are stacked. Yasuo's doing his thing. I think we're okay here. Thankfully, they had no two stars. <laughs> Hundreds of Jeopardy boards? Alright, let's, you know. Oh, we found the vein. Cool. Two star gangplank. Good. I gotta take the recycle out soon. Uh, level 5 AFK, a lot of threats, but not much else. Maybe we'll be okay here. Mort, can I have some Pepsi? I mean, they were finally on sale, so I bought like 20 12 packs, so. Uh, better together next, not an augment anymore. We took that out. Can we just hear this song? Eh, whatever. I'll let it play. How many? I mean, a lot. I have a lot in my garage. Ooh, another vein and a kale. Let's go. An early two star vein would be sweet. It was River in a Dry Land last. Oh, okay, cool. I can't wait for the 2024 pack. <laughs> Did removing better together make Chalice and Locket underperform? Nope, those are actually both doing quite fine. Ugh. Oh wait, Quicksilver? I can just make Quicksilver here. The problem is, without any two stars, it's not really worth leveling up. And Quicksilver on Vayne is kind of like, not great. Hold for Last Whisper. Uh, well, let's see who our opponent is. Hopefully we hit something good here.
D claw slam seems not correct. I don't think it's D claw slam. I want to see who my opponent is. We can win this. We can win this. I don't need to slam anything. I don't need to slam anything. We can just win this. All right, fingers crossed for a vein augment. Uh, silly fishies, appreciate the four months. Thank you. How often do you find the TFT team needs designers? Very often. <laughs> very, very often. Oh, well, I guess it's Knife's Edge. Knife's Edge isn't bad, it just isn't a vein augment. There's no way this positioning can be right, right? This feels so incorrect. <laughs> this feels so incorrect to put Vayne up there. Something seems very wrong here, but that is a Sejuani 2 due to Recombobulator. Okay. Hi, Man Prime. Appreciate the tier one. I mean, hitting the Vein 2 was good. Hitting the Zed was obviously huge. If we win this round... God, what if... There's got to be some positioning that's like this. Which is also dumb, but... Ugh, I don't like this. Uh, Time Man Prime, appreciate the tier one. Thank you. I would love to work for TFT, but I live in Germany, so there's no way. No, unfortunately, you'd have to relocate. Uh, Book Ducks, appreciate the tier one as well for three months. Happy birthday and Chris. Not my birthday! That's an Alistar 2, Annie 2. A lot of strong boards. But they're also level 5, so maybe we're okay. Any New Year's resolutions? Yeah, I'm going to post them tomorrow, actually. I've got... On the 30th, I want to post stuff about my stream, and on the 31st, I'm going to post stuff about work. That's my plan. Eight-round win streak, because Duelist is uh, super balanced. Uh, we're not going to get the item we want, so we should just start planning for backups here. Hmm. What are the backups here? I don't even know what the backups are here. Alright, I guess I'm slamming a Dragon Claw? I don't know, man. Maybe it's just that. Six duelists, three laser core, two recon. Now Vayne can roll away. Our items are bad, but... Well, actually, they're not bad. These cloaks, though. I 
Why not Sam D-Claw? Because nobody really needs a D-Claw here. There's no one tanky enough to really warrant it. When going duelist, do you play high tempo and play aggressively early? Yes. Yes. Especially with the locket. Neela can use the Dragon Claw. Oh yeah, where's Neela? I could use Neela for my comp. Mad Banners, appreciate the 35 months. Holy moly. That's a lot of months. Uh, add song to playlist. What do we got here? All right. Added. Uh, would an AP Jax build be viable like JG Deathcap with Quicksilver RFC Rageblade? Yeah. Yeah, there's builds like that that work. I used to be, a lot of people used to run Jeweled Gauntlet as his third item. Like Jeweled Gauntlet Rageblade. And this bugged out. Whatever, I'll fix it later. Quicksilver diff. That would have been really rough if I died there. Pure Augment is 100% chance after double or silver augments. Alright, well, we're hoping for a Zed or a... Uh, Vane. Zed or Vane. Actually, Neela wouldn't even be bad here. I would take Neela. Here, I'm gonna fix the thing I need to fix. There we go. That's fixed. Cool. Is three cost augment possible at four two? Yep. Quite likely, in fact. Armor. Oh goody. Forty. There's a Neela. I mean Neela's certainly better there. not need tank items for my duelist comp. This was a really bad itemization. Like, the items the items we got might cost us the game. Uh, Raisin, appreciate the 11 months. Good roll, Vayne. Way to get away. Then way to roll right back. Alright, Vayne trolling me, then rolls right back into the Ramus. Thankfully it didn't matter. Whew. Show us your big meat. I mean, my meat's pretty big. Look how big that is. Uh, Kaisa, threat, this. I'm gonna reroll. Please, please, please don't give me the other one. Thank you. GG. That's a big one. Uh, we can't go eight duelists, so we just plan around this. Yeah. What does it do? So uh, when you field Zed, your team gains 9% attack speed. As soon as you kill one thing, uh, it triples to 27% attack speed, which is really good. And on takedown, you dash to new targets. So now my guys move very, very quickly. So you'll see once they get a kill, things are going to go crazy. There they go. Stuck on this Annie, though. True damage, please. That was a little close. That was a little close. We need Last Whisper. I mean, we'll either get it or we won't. Oh, Fermata. Oof, already out. Oof. The 
There is a world where this is better than Gangplank, so I'm going to hold it for now. Can slow roll 7 for Vayne 3? Nah, I'm going to go to 8 at least. I can go to 8 and then... I mean, with this much win streak, there's no reason to roll on 7. Duelist Bedge? I agree, Arnold. I agree, Arnold. I think it is Bedge. I played what I hit. That's a two-star Viego at six. Neat. Get away, Vane! Uh-oh. This is looking kind of close. Oh, God. Oh, God, that was close. Ash one was the only thing left. Uh, I mean, again, the item we want is X. We're probably not going to get it. Plan for backups. It's still there. Hypothetically. It's still there. And then Arnold took it. Arnold, I know what you're doing there. It's messed up. That was not some good hits. That was not the good hits we needed. Thankfully, we're still okay, it looks like. Whew. These fights are a little close, though. Please turn the music down. It's pretty quiet. I can't really turn it down much further. But there you go. It's a big Jax. Vane, could you please roll away from the Jax? Vane? Whew. Again, fights are a little closer than I'd like, but... What are you gonna do? The problem is I still need recon no matter what I do here, so... But the fact we made it 100 health and we still haven't slammed in items, we should be good. Oh, there's a bow. Another bow? Alright, so if we go Last Whisper... We might have to go Last Whisper plus this.
can run that. I think Arnold wins this though. Yeah. Feels like the only way we come back from here would be Vein 3, and even that's pretty questionable. Hmm. Why Vein carry instead of Zed? I mean, yeah, I could switch to Zed. The problem with Zed, though, is I don't have any uh, lifesteal, so I'd need to get Hacker in. But that is definitely an option. If you switch out Vayne, you don't need Recon? I know, I'm thinking. I don't have any hackers right now anyway, so it's kind of a moot point, but... Drop to four duelists? No, 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 definitely six duelists. Yeah, it's gonna come down to me and Arnold, as it usually does. Who's Arnold? Uh, he's just somebody who joins the viewer games every once in a while, and I know he's hit GM before, so I know he's good. He won one of our viewer tournaments. So he's just always someone you gotta watch out for in our games. Ugh. Hmm. Yeah, but I mean, this is why Duelist is such a good top four, right? Like, we got to this spot pretty easily without really trying. So... Uh, no hacker emblem or anything. Uh, let's see here. Hey Mort, how did you get that thunder when you went around? Uh, you buy the Baron Bundle. The Baron Bundle has it. Okay, there I have the hackers now if I want to do the switch. If I want to do the switch, I have the hackers. I can go Quicksilver IE here, keep the Last Whisper on a backliner. I don't need it on Zed. Roll down and see what happens. I mean, there's no need to roll down yet.
This is our hardest matchup for sure. But it's also the matchup I don't really need recon for, so... Okay. Whew! Whew! There's another Zed player. I don't think Zed 3 is the truth. Is there another Zed player? Let me look. We've got time to look after this. Uh, this person does not have any Zeds. This person does not have any Zeds, and this person does not have any Zeds. There's no Zed player. I just really have to make the call right now if I'm switching to Vein 3 or Zed 2. And I feel like it's Vein 3, but I could just be messing this up. This is one of those hard calls I'm just not as sure on. I think it's... I really think it's... Now that we have Zed with this many items, I think it's just Vein 3. The thing we have to figure out is, do I level up? I really... God, this is hard. This is really hard. This is a hard matchup. Ox Force. Uh, yeah, if I level up, I put in Hacker is the thing. I need to roll down. 72 health is why I'm not, but... I'm gonna lose every fight from here on out if I don't roll. Yeah, like, there goes my... Be there goes my, uh, Vein. Zed 3 greater than level 9? I don't think that's actually true, especially in this matchup. That matchup just obliterated me. 6 Ox Force is really hard. Alright, we're down to 3. The Ox Force player is the hard part. That's a Nunu 3, or Nunu 2, I mean. That's uh, scary. Yep, still lost that fight. Sacking Knife Edge, yeah, I was toying with it because of the Ox Force, but... Pretty sure it's incorrect. I feel like Bane 3 can take the Viego. That's why I wasn't worried about frontlining against the Viego. Yeah, Bane 3 is good. It just. Is there a Zed? Uh, there's no Zed.
Yeah, I, th I think Arnold's gonna win this. I don't know. I don't feel strong enough, but... I feel like level 9's the play? Yeah, I agree. The Nunu 2, I think, just makes this unbeatable, though. Because Nunu, Nunu is really overpowered right now. And Arnold knows it. Yeah. Alright. I'm gonna roll for the Z3, but I'm pretty sure it's a second. Sad thing is, it's still just a Z3. It's still just a Z3. I'm still I actually think I still lose this. Pretty handily. Which, yes, for those who are about to say, doesn't that mean it's a problem? Like, yes. <laughs> Obviously. Uh, Zed? I'm sorry I doubted you, Zed. Holy moly, I sorry I doubted you. Sorry I doubted you, Zed. Champ Duplicator. <laughs> oh, sad. Fingers crossed. And Zed is CC'd. Zed, Zed, Zed. Whoo! Holy moly. Thank you, Zed. Sorry I doubted you. <laughs>